got here the night before, a little bit early, and it is one beautiful scene. Just watching that giant fog bank roll in over the lake. Good morning. We are here on the approach trail, the Quandary Peak West Ridge route. It's gonna be class three. I am thinking for the most part after doing my homework that it's mostly a hike with a short section of class three, fairly near the summit on the West Ridge. The beginning of this route is actually heading west past Blue Lakes and uh, until you get to a high point on the ridge, on the West Ridge, and then heading east on the West Ridge to the summit. So that's my story. I've been hiking for about a half an hour now. It has been a beautiful trail and there have been a lot of reports of people getting lost, going the wrong way. Um, it's important right at the beginning of the hike at the dam to turn up or north uphill, follow the Cairns and make your way from there. It is a pretty morning trail. It is beautiful, tons of flowers. And as you can see, the sun is just starting to illuminate my backdrop. So we'll see you up there. Must have been some tough living. Amazing. Important little bit of beta here. As you approach the beautiful waterfalls and mesmerizing ponds, don't let it lull you into thinking you go to the waterfalls. That is where you take a left. And uh, I started going the wrong way, but then I noticed these cairns and I made it pretty obvious. You're gonna be heading up this slope here and then actually staying somewhat left on the slabs and then working right to gain the saddle. I would assume right above the largest snow field in the center of the frame. Loving it. And I was just starting to wonder. I think we're good. Above the small lakes, there is one kind of poopy loose section well marked with uh, Karen's at the base and then kind of a free-for-all up the rocks and some dirt but you'll know when you get to the highest lakes and at that point you definitely kind of want to work a little to the right miss out on that snow field cruise on up here and I am just about to push up on the west ridge of Pondry now and I found a uh, very obvious trail that is just paralleling the ridge crest just to the south. I'm cruising that right now. And it's uh, 
easy to follow and relatively friendly. It's just about to make a left. You get a nice little view. Wow, very cool. Look who's here. Hi, sweetie. It's okay, mama. Go on your way. Good girl. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Can I see your baby? Oh my god. Definitely another fantastic ridge. Trail kind of runs out down below. We'll come straight up this gully. I'd stay on the firmer rock, not the dirt, but uh, make sure that rock is stable. And then we've got the ridge here. Looks like I got a little help finding the way here. So, uh, locals showing me their stuff. Definitely cool. All right, guys, we'll see you at the summit. Pretty sure I can go that way. Just got done with a couple third class moves. Probably could make it easier staying in the gully the whole time. Um, but it is cool and fun. Now, if I can just fit through here with all my crap. Oh. The water bottle. There we go. Awesome, man. So here's the crux, right here. Looks way doable. Though it's cruising away.
Alrighty, well here we are, along with everybody else. Unbelievable. Heavy weather, looks like it's gonna be coming in real soon as well. So I am gonna keep on moving. We are just leaving the West Ridge and it was a, a pretty, pretty easy descent as well. You know, there, there are some class three down climbs. We're gonna get some heavy weather shortly. For now, it's just making a beautiful scene. just gotten out of the basin. We're back to the big Blue Lake Reservoir and the sky has turned nasty. So again, for a route like this, you definitely want to be off a ridge where you could be trapped and exposed to lightning, slippery wet rocks. So it was spectacular. I thought this was going to be crowded and overrun and the summit was, but the rest of it was fantastic. All the mountain goats were just beautiful. The flowers were not bad either. And the vistas from the west side of Quandry Peak were amazing, to say the least. So uh, I highly recommend this trip as well. Again, you need to be prepared to do class three and doing your homework for the weather is also important. There is a little bit more complicated route finding, but hopefully this video has uh, clarified a lot of those issues so uh, again world-class awesome 14er climb very low people on the west side the east side is one of the most popular 14er climbs in all of Colorado I think second only to Mount Bierstadt so keep all those facts in mind and hopefully you enjoyed this adventure and we will catch up with you on the next thanks for joining me we'll see you soon